Uh, hello to everyone. Uh, I'm Martin for, from Figus. It's a cooperative software uh, development uh, from Argentina. Uh, I've been working, as uh, Raul said, in a feature for the chat uh, in order to uh, replicate communications between anything that is connected to the chain. Uh, so I'll first show kind of a white box uh, uh, demo and then the, the black box, no, sorry, black box and then white box. Uh, as you can see, I have two instances of the Sulip chat. Uh, this is, uh, I would say, the main, and this is the second one. Uh, so I'll just uh, send a message. A lot. Mm. Just send the message. I have something running here. The chain replica is the one that uh, upload the message to the, the blockchain. It doesn't really matter now how to understand how it does it. But the important part is that it will do it. Um, <clears throat> we need to wait success. success. Uh, so suppose that you set up a new instance and you run this script that I made uh, in order to get the messages, the new messages, right? Or, or the one for that are on chain. There you have, you see that it added one, one, one of four, but it's not four. I also uh, connected to um, a Tommy's lab instance of Sulip. So now you'll see here that the message messages are here, or well, the message I sent, right, is here. And Domislav also should have that. Um, we can check that. I, if 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 you don't mind, I will show some uh, developer things. I would say <laughs> this is the the database. This one is from the first instance. Then I have the second instance, as you can see, Postgres.2. And finally, the one from uh, Tommy's lab. So there's a new message here in the first one. In the second one. And finally, in the one from Tommy's lab. The same message is replicated in every um, instance connected to the chain. Uh, and if you, Tomislav, have the, also your mm -hmm. instance, or it doesn't really matter that. Yeah, I can show you later. But yeah, I see, I see the yeah. message. Okay, yes. I trust you. <laughs> um, <clears throat> so yeah, if you, if I can uh, show you other part of this, um, the script just get the, using Roland, we get the tables, the keys, and all of that, and the records, of course, and all of that is parsed in order to um, replicate those messages. Actually, are not only the messages, because as we can see, also the, the record in the user message table. Uh, the message has uh, a bit more information related, as we can see here in the diagram. Oh, I'm better to do it here. Um, so the message, what we are uh, copying now is the message and the user message. But there are a lot of other uh, tables and information that should be copied. Uh, so this is just the, the tip of the iceberg, I would say, uh, in order to replicate information properly. Um, so uh, this is uh, actually Thomas Lab also updated this uh, raw part to JSON in order to parse all the information. So this code should be three lines, I would say, uh, to parse the, the data, get it from the chain. Um, so th basically, that's what the, the script does. Um, 
I know if you have any question or I went too quick <laughs> and and you need to me to clarify anything. Yeah, I mean, this is super exciting. We really appreciate it. I do have one question. Um, so, so actual work days, as opposed to communication and coordination days, actual work days, how long did it take you to do this? Code? Yeah. Four days. And I've never code in Roland, to be honest. Yes, that's what I like to hear. <laughs> uh, it, it wasn't really, well, I, I work in the IT industry. So I've been working in, in this industry for 15 years, I guess. So if you're a senior developer, it shouldn't take too long to understand uh, how to, to do this. And if you're a blockchain developer, oh, easier. I can do almost everything. So it's, it's a different parting, but it's not that hard. And that's what I like to hear. We were recently talking with some, some folks who, who felt that the, uh, the adoption curve was going to be very steep. And, and we love to see the data points like this, which prove that wrong. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that you're taking the time to demo. And we're looking forward to doing a lot more work uh, with uh, our sister co-op, Ficus. This is awesome. Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, to First, to answer our email. <laughs> and, uh, and uh, of course, uh, having some uh, chats and calls and giving us the opportunity to work together. Great. Looking forward to doing more.